I'm Steph Strickland with GeekWire Studios. We are here to talk about innovation takeaways at the Tableau Conference. I am joined now by Lex Vogt. She is with Stanford Medicine, the Director of Supply Chains and Systems and Analytics. It's a big title. What does it mean? Break it down for me. Yeah, so really we sit at the intersection of our business users and all of the different variable data systems and data that comes into the organization. And we transform that into meaningful insights for our users to take day-to-day -day actions to for, uh, further their operations. You're sitting in the keynote and you're hearing the innovations and what's coming. Give me your initial reaction. For me, what I really loved about the keynote was just this culture of democratizing data and making uh, the uh, data insights really accessible, both from a business perspective, so some of the C-suite that we serve, as well as breaking down the ability to develop in a more agile way with AI enhancing some of our development capabilities through things like Copilot. What stood out to me first was the, the marketplace. So there's going to be some really cool data monetization opportunities for, for businesses, right? So having that opportunity to put together data packages and monetize them, be able to make some money off of that, but also having that aligned um, data vision within your company. So having that marketplace available just internally is really cool too. So everyone's working off of the same calculations, the same metrics, and just that trust is really in embedded into the, the product. Uh, I liked the presentation on uh, using Einstein and data prep. Uh, that's a new feature that I think would be really useful, especially we're onboarding a lot of our uh, data prep into Tableau, so that would be really useful to see, I think. The two things that I'm most excited about are the Viz extensions and then the Figma plugin, because I just got off a project where I was doing a lot of wireframing, and if I was doing it in Figma, and then I had to rebuild it all in Tableau, and just being able to do it in Ta or in Figma, and then like with the click of a button, get it in Tableau and get my worksheets going, oh my gosh, that's gonna be life-changing. And I really like that everything now I can, as a developer, I have that assistant with me all the time. So it's just something that I will always uh, look, we're looking for. And uh, that's something that we do. You know, we actually going sometimes to chat GPT, but why, why do we need to do that now? It's integrated, it's in there now. So that's, that's what I, uh, that's what I love. I mean, it just, I, I was very excited with everything that they said today. And I am joined now by Brim Basim, who is with Goosehead Insurance. You're the managing director of technology and innovation for the team. How are you doing today? I'm doing great, how are you? I have to know how you set in on that keynote. What got you excited today? Yeah, I mean, I love the energy, right? I think I was at a TC last year, good energy, but this year was like next level um, on the data and just all the new features that are coming. So it's really exciting to see the innovation and the plans they have coming in the roadmap. Were there specific innovations that really caught your ear? I think, you know, we're on the beta for Copilot. So seeing where that's coming, and I'm really interested in like building that for my own org. So that's going to be exciting just to kind of see where we can go with that. Um, I also really like the fact that you are going to work with Microsoft. You know, I know Slack's a big company that sells for its own, right, and, and big integrations there. But we also use Microsoft. So I think for my end users that are heavy on Microsoft, that would be really nice to be able to plug in some of the Tableau aspects into that work stream. Was Copilot one of your favorite innovations? I would say absolutely Copilot from that perspective of helping my analysts go further with their own skill sets and their own capabilities to bring meaning to our business users just faster. And the other thing that I'm very interested in after today is Pulse. So how do we help our executives really focus on the most essential insights from all of this enormous data that we work with so that they can go about making decisions in their day more quickly. What are some of the ways you've been able to solve problems for your clients using Tableau and some of the integrations that we're talking about? Sure, um, so the, with, with Tableau and our entire social ecosystem, uh, you know, we're, a lar we're the largest insurance agency in the country that's publicly traded. So we have agents and we have franchises and we have our end consumers as well, right? So with the tool set, we were able to increase our, improve our efficiency by about 80% when you're going to quoting somebody. So that's time saved for our agents, allowing them to access that data quicker and also consolidate it all into Salesforce and serve it to them in the right way. Did you sit in on the keynote today? Yes. What got you excited? <gasps> Actually, so many um, information and there, I think that there will be uh, the drastic change will be waited, uh, will be uh, awaiting for us. So we believe that we have people to see and understand data with drag and drop. But I think that the, in the future, our style might be changed a little bit, maybe including AI or the, the, our 
uh, expertise might be changed, but I believe um, as a data farm and also the table creator, we can find the new way to, to be a brilliant creator to help people to see and understand data. What is it that makes the Tableau conference so special? You mentioned you've been in this space for a while now. What is it that you like about coming here? Uh, to me, it's all about people, actually. So you're working with people, you're buying from people, uh, my team, right? So I really like the networking, talking to other industries, um, different businesses, because we all have a lot of the same pain points, right? And so you can remove all the terminology, but at the end of the day, we're trying to say, solve a lot of the similar problems. So that's one of the biggest aspects I get is just the, the diversity of the groups here and being able to talk to different people that are like-minded. Brim, thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you for having me. I'm Steph Strickland with GeekWire Studios.